Welcome to today's video where we'll dive into the life-changing topic of how to pay off debt and achieve financial freedom. Imagine a life without the burden of debt, where you can live on your terms and make the choices you've always wanted. But before we get there, it's essential to understand that the road to financial freedom is paved with persistence, determination, and well-informed decisions. That's where this video comes in. We'll provide you with practical tips and strategies to help you tackle your debt head on and make significant strides towards financial independence. Remember, I am not a financial advisor. These videos are for educational purposes only. Investing of any kind involves risk. While it is possible to minimize risk, your investments are solely your responsibility. It is imperative that you conduct your own research. I am merely sharing my opinion with no guarantee of gains or losses on investment. Stay tuned as we dive into each of these topics, providing you with valuable insights and practical advice to help you conquer your debt and achieve financial freedom. So let's get started and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more expert financial advice. The first step on your journey to financial freedom is to assess your financial situation. This process may seem daunting, but it's essential to understand where you stand before creating a plan to tackle your debt. Let me guide you through this process in a simple and engaging way so you don't miss out on any crucial information. Start by gathering all your financial documents, including bank statements, credit card bills, loan statements, and other relevant records. This will give you a clear picture of your current financial standing, including your income, expenses, and outstanding debt. Next, list all your debts, noting the outstanding balance, interest rate, and minimum monthly payments for each. This overview will help you determine the total amount of debt you need to pay off and which debts are the most expensive in terms of interest. Now calculate your net worth by subtracting your total liabilities, debts, from your total assets, savings, investments, property, etc. This number represents your current financial health and will serve as a benchmark to track your progress towards financial freedom. Lastly, analyze your spending habits by categorizing your expenses into essential and non-essential items. This will help you identify areas where you can potentially cut back and allocate more money towards debt repayment. By thoroughly assessing your financial situation, you'll gain valuable insights into your financial health and have a solid foundation to create a debt repayment plan tailored to your unique circumstances. Remember, knowledge is power and understanding your financial situation is the first step to regaining control of your finances and achieving financial freedom. Creating a realistic budget is a crucial step towards paying off your debt and achieving financial freedom. By establishing a budget, you'll be able to track your income and expenses, identify areas to cut back, and allocate more funds towards debt repayment. Let's dive into this topic and make sure you don't miss any essential information. Start by listing all your sources of income such as salary, side hustles, and passive income streams. Next, categorize your expenses into fixed expenses rent, mortgage, insurance, etc., and variable expenses, groceries, entertainment, etc. This will give you a clear picture of where your money is going each month. Now set spending limits for each category, prioritizing essential expenses and debt repayment. It's crucial to be realistic and allocate enough funds for your day-to-day -day needs while still chipping away at your debt. Track your expenses regularly and adjust your budget as needed to ensure you're staying on track. You might need to make some lifestyle adjustments, but remember that these sacrifices are temporary and will lead to a brighter financial future. By following a realistic budget, you'll be well on your way to paying off your debt and achieving financial freedom. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the like button if you find this information helpful. We're here to support you on your journey to financial success. Prioritizing your debts is a smart strategy to tackle debt repayment more efficiently and achieve financial freedom sooner. By focusing on the most critical debts first, you can save money on interest and gain momentum as you pay off each debt. Start by listing all your debts, including credit cards, personal loans, student loans, and any other outstanding balances. Note the interest rates and minimum payments for each debt. Next, decide on a repayment strategy that works best for your situation. There are two popular methods to prioritize debts, the avalanche method and the snowball method. The avalanche method targets the debt with the highest interest rate first, while the snowball method focuses on the smallest balance first. Both methods have their merits. 
and you should choose the one that fits your preferences and keeps you motivated. Once you've chosen a strategy, create a plan to tackle each debt in the order you've determined. As you pay off each debt, redirect the funds to the next one on the list, creating a snowball effect to accelerate your debt repayment journey. Stick to your plan and you'll see progress towards financial freedom. When it comes to paying off debt, two popular methods are the debt snowball and debt avalanche. Understanding the differences between these approaches will help you choose the best one for your situation and stay motivated on your journey towards financial freedom. The debt snowball method focuses on paying off the smallest balance first while still making minimum payments on other debts. Once the smallest debt is paid off, you move to the next smallest and so on. The idea is to create a sense of accomplishment and momentum as you tackle each debt. On the other hand, the debt avalanche method targets the debt with the highest interest rate first. You pay off that debt as quickly as possible while making minimum payments on the rest. Once it's paid off, you move to the debt with the next highest interest rate. This method saves you money on interest payments in the long run. Both methods have their merits. The snowball method may provide quicker wins and motivation, while the avalanche method can save more money. The key is to choose the method that aligns with your financial goals and keeps you motivated throughout your debt repayment journey. Finding additional income streams can significantly speed up the process of paying off debt and achieving financial freedom. By diversifying your income, you're not solely relying on your primary job to cover your expenses and pay down your debt. Consider exploring side hustles or part-time gigs that align with your skills and interests. For example, you could start freelancing, offering your services on platforms like Upwork or Fiverr. If you're passionate about a specific topic, you could create and sell online courses or write an ebook. Alternatively, you might explore the gig economy through ride-sharing, food delivery, or pet sitting apps. Another approach is to invest in assets that generate passive income such as dividend stocks, rental properties, or peer-to-peer -peer lending platforms. Keep in mind that these options may require an initial investment and come with their own risks. Remember, the goal is to supplement your primary income, so choose opportunities that are manageable and don't negatively impact your work, life balance. As you earn extra money, use it strategically to pay off debt and move closer to financial freedom. Developing an emergency fund is a crucial step in achieving financial freedom and preventing debt from spiraling out of control. An emergency fund is a stash of money set aside to cover unexpected expenses such as medical bills, car repairs, or job loss. By having the safety net in place, you can avoid relying on credit cards or loans when emergencies arise, preventing additional debt. To start building your emergency fund, determine how much you'll need to cover three to six months of living expenses. This amount will vary based on your individual circumstances and financial obligations. Next, open a separate high-yield savings account dedicated solely to your emergency fund. This keeps the money separate from your regular spending and allows it to earn interest over time. Begin contributing to your emergency fund regularly, even if it's just a small amount at first. Automate your savings by setting up direct deposits from your paycheck or use budgeting apps to round up your purchases and transfer the difference to your emergency fund. With consistency and discipline, you'll be well on your way to financial security. Staying committed to your financial goals is the key to achieving financial freedom and paying off debt. It's essential to remain focused, disciplined, and motivated throughout your journey. To stay committed, start by setting clear, achievable financial goals, break them down into smaller milestones, and celebrate your progress along the way. This will help you stay motivated and focused on the bigger picture. Next, keep yourself accountable by tracking your spending and monitoring your progress. Use budgeting tools and apps to make this process easier and more efficient. Regularly review your financial situation and adjust your plan as needed. Surround yourself with a supportive network of people who share your financial goals. Join online communities, forums, or local groups to connect with others who are working towards similar objectives. Sharing your experiences, challenges, and successes with others can provide motivation and encouragement. Lastly, maintain a positive mindset and practice patience. Remember that financial freedom doesn't happen overnight. It takes time, effort, and dedication. Stay resilient and keep your eyes on the prize. In summary, achieving financial freedom and paying off debt requires assessing your financial situation, creating a realistic budget, prioritizing debts, 
choosing a debt repayment method, finding additional income streams, building an emergency fund, and staying committed to your financial goals. By following these steps and staying dedicated, you can make significant progress toward financial independence. Thank you for watching this video. If you found it helpful, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel for more valuable financial advice. Until next time, good luck on your journey towards financial freedom.